the producers and distributors of Tech AV instructional video programs welcome you to this overview program on the subject of belt and chain drives. The main objective of this program is to introduce you to two important drive methods, namely V-belts and roller chains, thus providing you with the necessary background information for future maintenance on such drives. Flexible drive components are very commonly used to transmit power from a drive motor to driven machinery. Many types of flexible drives are used for power transmission in modern day industry. Drives such as roller chains, V-belts, flat belts, and toothed belts, also known as synchronous or timing belts, are amongst those you will encounter as you work within industry. Machinery such as compressors, product pumps, and ventilation fans are often driven via a flexible drive such as V-belts or wedge belts. Another popular drive is the roller chain, which is highly adaptable. Not only are such chains used to transmit power from a motor to a driven assembly, but they can also be used to carry or convey loads directly upon them. Where hot products are manufactured, chain conveyors are better suited to cope with the higher temperatures involved. Both chains and belts have advantages and disadvantages, depending upon the application. Major considerations for the use of a belt as a power transmitting component is its low cost, flexibility and ease of maintenance. With the exception of synchronous or toothed belts, a certain amount of slippage occurs during operation, which on some applications is desirable as this can act as a simple clutch, but in the process, heat and static are generated, which could be a problem in hazardous areas. Roller chains, on the other hand, do not slip and are therefore safer devices to use in hazardous environments. Chains are often used to operate a multi-shaft machine where accurate timing of a process is essential. During your practical experience in industry, you will be exposed to many drive types, each requiring a different approach when it comes to maintenance. It is the aim of this program to overview the two most commonly used components, namely V-sectioned belts and the so-called standard roller chains. <laughs>